Good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video. I'm having such a fabulous hair day today, but today, you guys, something very exciting is happening, which you can obviously know already from the title of today's video, but Miss Hunter is being reunited with her brother and sister. So Margot, who was previously Fern and Huckleberry, which kept the name Huckleberry, are coming over and they're gonna be all reunited and they're gonna be playing in the yard. And I'm so excited because I have not seen them and I'm so curious like what the size comparison is gonna be, their coloring, all the things. I'm just very excited to see. And also Montana is here here and you're gonna be reunited with two of your children but three of them total hey get that out of your mouth miss grass oh my god that snoot is dirty look at this sweet woman you don't even realize what's about to happen you're gonna be playing all afternoon with your siblings are you excited to see them for the first time oh my goodness hawk <gasps> Oh my goodness, your sister and your mom are so excited to see you. He is a big boy. Oh my goodness. Let's go in the backyard and see. Oh, do you guys remember me? Oh, Squeakums. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, I missed you guys. Oh, do you remember me? Hi. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hunter is not a kisser at all, so I'm not used to this. Come here, buddy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, Hunter does not give me this amount of love. How come? Did I choose the wrong one? Should I have chosen you? <laughs> okay, I have Hunter. Oh, who's that? Hunter, who's that? Oh my goodness. The reunion. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so red. I know, she's so much darker than them. Look at Triplets. Do you remember it back here? Wait, is that Huck? Yeah. And your Margo. Hi. Hi. Oh my goodness. Do we need to get your mother out here? I think we need to get your mom out here. Mother, do you want to go see your kids? Oh my goodness. It's a golden retriever party. It's a golden party. Those are your children. Oh my God, they all look the same size. <laughs> They're like, mother. <laughs> She has no interest in seeing her mother. Well, I feel like there was a more of an interaction with Hunter than they're having with... Yeah, for sure. Who is that? Wolfie, you want to see them now? Wolfie, go see. Wolfie! <laughs> this is Wolfie's pure hell. He's like, just kidding, I want to leave! <laughs> Not what I wanted! Okay, so now Wolfie's out here. Him and Huck love each other. Uh, we had an incident where Huck was trying to, um, you know, mount his mother, which is a little interesting, Mr. Huck. Oh. Okay, so the puppies just left. <gasps> Drama has struck. Moon and Wolf got into an altercation and Wolf literally was acting as if his leg was broken, but he's fine. Oh, so scary. Dog fights are intense. And uh, Moon is the one that has a little bit of a wound, but he's totally fine. It's just like a little. Hi, hello. The craziness of having dogs. Moon, do you want to show your scar? Wolfie, you got him. You protected yourself, huh? As you guys know, Moon is, you know, he has his little issues here and there. He can't really be around male dogs. He's really good with female dogs, but Wolfie's a very submissive dog. But if you push Wolfie past his boundaries, he will retaliate. So Wolf 
stood up for himself and Moon's the one who has a little scar on his face. So let me show you a little bit. What happened? Yeah, he cut you a little bit. Yeah, that's what happens when you pick fights. It's nothing that requires stitches or anything. It's just a little nick. But yeah, Wolf was like limping and stuff. And I was like, Wolfie, do you want a treat? And he like, <laughs> he suddenly could walk again. <laughs> Couldn't you, Wolfie? Did you enjoy seeing your kids? Yeah, that was, that was sweet. Okay, Mooney's all cleaned up. His cut is fine. They're totally fine with each other too. They're back to being brothers. Huh, yeah, you guys are crazy. Get in there. And Wolf, he's just waiting for dinner. He's like, I think I deserve a little bit earlier than usual, please. You like to scare the crap out of me though? Uh-huh. It's weird because I like saw a TikTok that was like how to break up a dog fight when it happens. I was like, you know what? This would be good to like watch just so I know in the future. And they're like, don't yell because it only increases the like intensity of the situation. And of course, first thing I do is yell. I'm like, stop it. Stop it. So I didn't know what to do. It's always just like, it's one thing to like prepare yourself. But when it actually happens, it's like, what do you do when it actually happens? It's just too much. So... I don't know, I was scared. Well, good morning. It's the next day and it is rainy. You have to go poopies, go poopies. She's like, no, it's so rainy out here. Go ahead, Monty. Oh wait, Monty doesn't pee here. Monty only pees in the yard. But yes, the rain is back in LA. You're getting drenched, miss. Hunter, come. No, no, out of the dirt, out of the, oh my God, not the mud, not the mud, not the mud, please. Okay, stay here, stay here, stay here. You're in the puppy room now. I have to go get a towel. And weirdly, just like that, the sun is out now. LA, you are very strange and weird, but I want to do a little recap, I'm out here with Monty, about the puppy interaction yesterday. So it was so freaking cute, the fact that they remembered me and they were squealing and giving me all the kisses. And I was like, you know, how I wish, I wish Hunter would do this with me. But then as like, I got to like interact with them, I was like, you know what? Hunter's temperament is perfect for me. She's way more chill and quiet. Those other two were just very rambunctious, had a lot of energy and were very jumpy. And I think I need the calm, sweet energy of the girl that I have. So I feel very lucky that I have Miss Hunter Lynn and she's the best girl. And she looks very similar to her mother, who's my favorite. But anyways, I'm about to go head to the thrift store to go get some clothing for Japan because I leave in a couple days and I want to try and find like some cute looks. Come on, Monty, let's go. She's literally so stubborn. She only comes on her own terms. Like watch, I'll come inside right now and then she'll come. Oh, there she is with her wet purse. No, come in here, drop the purse. It needs to dry off in the sun. I'm back from shopping and I want to share with you guys everything that I got. And then I need to start putting outfits together because I literally leave tomorrow. So I gotta act quick because I don't have time. I got these really sick jeans that are like custom. I actually don't know, but they look like they were custom made by someone, but I can't tell. They probably aren't. And then I got these loafers at Doc Martens. They're not broken in yet and I know they're gonna kill my feet, but I think they're really cool. I want to go for like a schoolboy aesthetic at least for one day. And yeah, just some cute little finds here and there. But now I need to start picking out clothes that I already have. So I'm gonna start pulling some looks together and we'll see what we come up with. There's a farmer boy here in my backyard. You know some of us are fashionable and some <laughs> of us are not. My daughters. Oh, both of them are yours. I birthed that one. <laughs> And I birthed this one. It came from my loins. No, oh, they're both mine. Did you see that figure? How stunning. Gorgeous. Get out! Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh! What were they doing? They were, it's mating season. They were mating. Look at all the feathers around us right here. Look. Oh, that was shocking. Hunter, no! Get! She likes to dig. Princess dirt. Get! So anyways, yes. I'm leaving today. Good. Are you happy I'm leaving? Yeah. Yes, actually yes. Uh, so you're gonna have all the dogs. And Storm, he's in the car actually, though. Hunter's about to be picked up. She's going to a training for the next two weeks while I'm gone. Look at myself, actually. Look at, you. look at yourself. Wow. You will never be a pretty girl. Wow. Not that angle. No, not that angle either. 
That's it. <laughs> My tiny little thing. So you're the man of the house now. So take care. I always have been. Oh, okay. Even in death. The woman of the house. <laughs> Camera's not even on me, sweetie. Oh. <laughs> There you are. All right, I need to go finish packing. Okay, well, I am all packed up and it is now time to head off. So if you guys wanna check in on my Japan adventure, make sure to subscribe to my main channel. Link is down below where I will be posting vlogs over there of my adventure over in Japan. So that's it for today. Until next time, I'll see you next time. Good damn, bye.